Okay. Basically, today, I'm going a, I'm to a teach you about this website. This website called Zoom Quilt. And basically, if we go back from the beginning, there's like 20 different types of Zoom Quilts, but the first one, right? This is this Zoom Quilt uh, website is quite the mystery, but I'll just let you watch it for a second. So if you look up Zoom Quilt, right? This website is gonna pop up, and if you notice, it's just gonna keep on zooming in, and zooming in, and zooming in, and zooming in, and it's, it's just gonna keep on going. Um, why, what, where, when, I, I'll tell you at least half of those answers later, but let's, let's get to what is this website? No, no, that, that seems like a grand finale question. Where did I find this website? Um, I found it just in the TikTok, whatever. Saying, oh, if you're tripping balls, well, look at this website. Oh, my God. But, um, <laughs> this website is very hypnotic. <laughs> Interesting, I must say. But, 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 I say that too much. Um, there's when where what why well first this website was made by nicolas in 2004 this specific one this one i believe all by himself because that's all the info that i could find it's just a website then if you notice where we started we started looking at the lizards forever looking downwards and it's I'm sorry if I'm bugging you by doing that but if you notice that it's it's moving so it is a video not an image so first thing I thought this what this was was it might have been a fractal uh, a fractal if you didn't know it's a singular image that you're able to keep on zooming in on and zooming in and zooming in and, and it's infinite there is no end but if you know wait no uh, if you notice about this one it's literally just an image that has an end it ends right about here right here is where the image starts and ends basically what I'm trying to explain here is it's technically of an image of the thing just zooming in. <laughs> it kind of says it in the title. It's if I speed it up here, oh wait, I just want to point something out. These websites I think might have a meaning. Here's the other one. Zoom Quilt 2 might have a meaning. I don't know. I couldn't find any meaning behind this one but here's the start of the image and let's we can't pause it but let's say if we just pause it if i can't but i can with the other one um if we pause it it's a still image and you're able to zoom in on still images you're able to zoom in and on it and on anything second thing pay attention to the lizard's tongues right pay attention to them they keep on going no matter what they're always there but basically, if you keep on zooming in, it comes more, and more, and more. And you might think this is only possible through the video. Um, no. You could, to tell you the truth, you could definitely stop at any point. And look, we're back with the lizards. You can stop at any point. Uh, pause it and you can just do this effect by yourself but you're gonna have to need a very very extremely high quality I don't know screen to enhance this much it's like enhancing from 
enhancing from a microscope to little bacteria. It's, it's, it's so much enhancement. It's, it's, it's impressive. But this website, I think I've already stated this before, Nicholas. Nicholas, this guy in 2004. And I guess we're calling these types of websites infinitely zooming, um, zoom quilts or whatever. So if you look at the second one, the second one's changing color and look at the evil ice cream. Um, for this one, I believe I've come up with a meaning behind zoom quilt two. Um, if you look here, it states that it's a zooming painting made in 2007 and the original concept, Nicholas, as you know, he made the original zoom quilt. Um, and here's the list of illustrators. Bravo to them making all zoom quilts too. If you notice on the zoom quilt website, there's two others. There's, I, I don't know how to pronounce this, where it's much more nature-like and not curious. It's a lot more nature-like. What are you just supposed to say? There's a river, mountains, tree stemming into smaller roots. And it's nature-like. <laughs> I don't know. And it's, like I said, it can be traced back and then zooming patterns. Well, this is unlike the others because of the video it adds new things to the middle so This one zoom What the hell infinitely zooming whatever They're not the same as This one because you see you're able to stop you're able to stop it and infinitely zoom until you see where you are back again you're able to keep on doing this look forever and ever and ever and zoom quilt 2 specifically changes colors so that's interesting you get seven different colors to look at it's pretty interesting and if i go back here yeah so why when where how the how it's just it's just, just an image that is incredibly detailed and they just made a zooming effect or they zoomed in and zoomed in and zoomed in and when it was a blank spot they zoomed in more created a picture until they kind of made a loop um here's zoom called two if you're interested like i said we're gonna start from the beginning notice the evil ice cream um I gotta say, not a fractal, not anything I've seen before. I don't know. It's, it's well, it's an image which we've seen on the daily, but it's an image that is building on a on a idea of zooming and. Like the fractals, infinitely zooming, but this is not infinite. And you kind of notice the whale and the face, and there's a hole, so you keep on going in there. It's another thing, another thing, and another thing. It keeps on going. Um, I really can't see any meaning behind this, except only for the beginning. <laughs> um even Mickey Mouse making pop culture references and an elephant looking at a giraffe <laughs> and then a guy says, says read books like he had an eight ball pointing somewhere Donald Duck King and stuff it's truly something mesmerizing um well yeah I think that's the end what is it it's it's a still image why uh, something for your brain to nibble on <laughs> while well, it just keeps on hypnotically zooming in and again and again. Where? On the internet, like many 
oddball things from your from Nicholas's imagination. When 2004 is when is when the idea first sprang up, the first website came up. How? Well, they got an image. They made a hole in the image. They zoomed in. They had a blank canvas. They filled that in, made another hole in the blank canvas, and zoomed into the hole. Until they had so many images, they're like they were satisfied with it, and relapsed it to the beginning. Um, two guys. It's really something to gaze at. You don't know if there's monsters or or it's a fight. You really don't know. <laughs> well. I'm gonna let this finish now and just have you let let you gaze at it for fun. Um some gnarly light bulbs. I really don't know what I'm looking at. Some feet looking at the feet. Looking at the feet it see it's a loop and it's changing colors. We're gonna keep on going. Um uh, I, why, when, where, I really don't know, I'm gonna blur that out, I don't know how to, but right here, uh, it says, zoom, enter the zoom world, at www.zoomquilt.org, um, what are you supposed to say, bro, it's, leave reality for a while, it's, I don't know, I don't know what this is, I'm so confused with this website, this is the only thing that it realizes that what it is, and there it is, we're back to the beginning with the evil ice cream, well, I hoped you understand getting a little bit of a grasp of Zoom Quilt, and maybe you'll look at it yourself, alright, bye bye.